Welcome to Movie Caps. Today, I will show you an American action thriller from 2021, titled, Out of Death. Spoilers ahead. Watch out, and take care. The story starts with Jack stopping two cops at gunpoint, then two gunshots are heard. After that, the movie starts to explain the backstory of the current events. A photojournalist named Shannon Mathers, arrives at Lake Easton remote forest lands for a hike. She wishes to climb the peak of the hills, where her late father spent most of his childhood. The trek is Shannon's journey to spread her father's ashes, and bid a final goodbye. She is nervous because this is her first time in a secluded place. She starts writing in her journal. Unfortunately, it starts to rain heavily, and she is unable to get to the peak of the hill. She picks up her father's ashes, and leaves the deed for some other time, with a little disappointment on her face. A drug dealer named Jimmy is in the forest, he seems to be getting high in his car, while waiting for someone. A police car stops behind his car, and the officer asks him to show his hands, but he does not move. The police officer is a girl named Billy, she then gets into the car with Jimmy and they start making out. Jimmy then gives her some money, and after a few minutes they start arguing over something. Shannon overhears everything, and understands that the police officer is definitely in league with the drug dealer. Shannon then starts taking pictures of them. On the other hand, Billy checks Jimmy's phone, and finds out that he has been recording everything that has been going on between them, and is now going to blackmail her. Jimmy gets out of the car and starts running away, but Billy shoots him in the head from behind, and he dies on the spot. In the next scene, we see Jack with his niece Pam, he has come to stay with her for a few days. Jack is grieving the recent passing of his beloved wife, and has been diagnosed with depression. He arrives at Pam's forest lodge, hoping to find peace away from his busy city life. Pam works for the mayor, and has a son named Sam. Pam tells Jack that he will really feel at ease in the quiet of the forest, and that he should make the most out of his trip. Jack leaves his badge and his phone at home, and goes out of the house carrying his gun, as Pam tells him that there are wild animals in the forest. Meanwhile, Billy deals with the body of the drug dealer Jimmy, and Shannon records everything on her camera. She tries to sneak away, but Billy spots her and chases her into the forest. Billy calls Hank and informs him, that someone has seen her murdering Jimmy. Hank tells her to kill Shannon, and sends his brother Tom to help Billy catch her. Tom goes to the forest and sees the dead body, he then calls Hank and says that Billy was right, she has really killed the man. Hank asks him to catch the girl who saw everything, and bring her to him. Tom takes the drugs and the cash from the car, and sets out to find Shannon in the forest. Meanwhile, Jack is hiking in the forest, and he runs into Billy, who acts like a nice person and an honest police officer. Billy is getting closer to Shannon, and keeps calling her to come out. She finally comes out and says, she will not say anything to anybody. Billy asks her to calm down and takes Shannon with her. She is online with Tom through her walkie-talkie, who asks if she has killed the girl. Shannon hears this and tries to run away, but Billy grabs her, Shannon bites her and manages to get away from her. She tries to escape, but Tom catches her and hits her in the head, knocking her out. They then tie her up and start talking. From their conversation, it turns out that Tom likes Billy, but she works for Hank, and considers Tom nothing more than Hank's dog. Meanwhile, Shannon wakes up, they come to her and ask what she has seen. Shannon says that she will say whatever they want her to say. Tom says they must ask Hank what to do with the girl. Tom then gives Billy the gun, and asks her to shoot the girl. Shannon begs for her life as Billy points the gun at her. In the meantime, Jack gets there and overhears everything. Tom keeps asking Billy to shoot the girl, but she hesitates. Jack throws a stone in the opposite direction, making Tom and Billy look the other way, he sneaks from behind and points his gun at them, he asks both of them to put their hands on their head and get on their knees. He tells them that he is a cop, and asks them to explain the situation to him. Billy lies and says Shannon is a drug dealer, Shannon on the other hand says that Billy is in league with the drug dealer, and she has killed the man. Both of them start talking, and Jack tells them to shut up and calm down. Jack then says that they are all going to the police station. Tom says that he is a cop and gets on his feet, and Jack does not shoot him. Shannon and Jack then run away, while Billy starts firing at them. However, they get lucky and Tom says that he is going to find them. Shannon gets into an old factory nearby, and tries to get out of the cuffs. Jack on the other hand is looking for her. Tom realizes that Jack and Shannon are not together, so he and Billy split up. Shannon finds a knife at the factory, and keeps it with her. Meanwhile, Billy gets there, and again tries to talk to Shannon, telling her that she is a good officer who can be trusted. She gets close to Shannon, and Shannon stabs her in the foot with a knife and runs away, 
Billy calls Tom and tells him about her situation, he tells her that he is on his way. After a while, Tom gets to Billy and tells her that Jimmy had been recording everything, and they are not about to get in big trouble. He says that he is called Hank because the situation is now getting out of hand. Shannon, who is really scared and nervous, goes near a pond where she meets Jack, he assures her that he is not going to hurt her. They then sit down, and Jack asks her to tell him the whole story from the beginning. She tells him what she was doing in the forest, and that her bag contains a lot of proof but it fell somewhere. Jack tells her that he does not have his phone with him, they then decide to go find their stuff and meet back at the same spot. On the other hand, Hank arrives in the forest, he sees Billy's injured foot and tells her everything will be fine. Hank then comes to Tom and says that Billy is of no use anymore, and asks him to kill her. Tom gets upset at this, but Hank gets angry and asks him to finish the job. Tom starts strangling Billy, and asks her to forgive him while she dies. Hank then says that they are now going to look for Jack and Shannon, and kill them. Tom tells him that on his way here, he saw a cabin in the forest. Hank says that they will blame Jack for murdering Billy. In the meantime, Jack is at the cabin, he takes his medicine, fills up his gun, and leaves to meet Shannon at the decided spot. Just as he is leaving from the back door, Hank enters the house from the other door, but does not see Jack. Tom on the other hand is dealing with Billy's body, telling her that he loved her, and kisses her. Shannon is sitting somewhere, looking at a picture of her father. This is when Tom gets there and sees her, she tries to outrun him but he catches her. Seeing death closing in on her, she remembers how she wanted to be brave like her father, how she wanted to explore the forest, and how Jack told her she is a brave girl. She then takes Tom's gun and shoots him to death. Hank tries to call Tom, but Tom is dead. He then starts searching the house, he sees Jack's depression pills in his badge. He then sees a picture of Pam with her family and understands the dynamics. He calls Pam and pretends to be an acquaintance of her uncle Jack, and says he wants to see her. Pam gives him Jack's number. In the meantime, Shannon finds her bag. Hank walks towards the forest, when he sees the bodies of both Billy and Tom, and decides that he is going to kill Jack. He calls one of his agents at the office, and asks him to call Pam to the office for a promotion, and not let her leave. The guy comes to pick Pam up from the house, telling her she is going to meet Hank. Pam senses that something about the situation doesn't feel right. Hank calls Jack and tells him that he is the mayor of the city, and he is his niece Pam. He demands that if he wants Pam, he will have to hand over Shannon. Shannon overhears everything. Jack asks Hank to leave Pam out of this, but Hank says he needs Shannon, he further adds that Jack should not have killed his brother Tom. To this Jack replies, he is not the one who killed his brother. Jack then understands that Shannon has killed Tom, and agrees to Hank's demands. Shannon gets scared and runs away. Hank hears her footsteps and chases her. Shannon goes to a nearby house, where she makes the girl in the house open the door at gunpoint. This is when Jack gets there, and explains to Shannon that he has a plan. Shannon and Jack pull off a very smart plan against Hank. Shannon uploads the drug bust evidence on the FBI official site, requesting an immediate SOS. Simultaneously, Jack calls Hank to the cabin, right off Route 92 in Easton Lake. When Hank arrives at the cabin, he finds Shannon pointing a loaded gun at him. While outside the house, Jack guns down corrupt officer Frank, and rescues his niece. Hank gets arrested and kills himself in jail. Pam becomes the mayor, and Jack is really happy living with her. Shannon comes to their cabin, and takes Jack out for a hike. The end. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this. Turn on the notifications and leave a like to help the channel out.